soldier healed. Listen up. We need you to clear the critters from this area. See to it that the task is done properly. If one sorry raptor whelp attacks the colonists after you're done, I will personally make sure that your agency doesn't receive a single contract from the Alliance. Contact! Commander, GSS scanners have detected strange radiation west of your position. We have nothing on the motion sensors, so you can move out quickly and identify the source of the radiation.
looks like this crate contains police equipment. But look at the Advanite crystals that they have grown on it. They're different from the usual form of the mineral. Please bring that container back to base. I'd like to study it more thoroughly. Attention all squad. Movement! A large pack of mutants is bearing down on the base. We've lost contact with our men on the outskirts. This operation is canceled. Get out of- He put it quite clearly. Get your men to the extraction point. The city was overrun, but it's not our fault. We completed our mission with minimum casualties, so the Alliance paid us in full. They were highly impressed with our performance, and mark my word, they will contact us again when they need the service of mercenaries. You came just in time, Commander. Union has another contract for us. As usual, the message is a collection of phrases such as top secret and disclosure is punishable by death. But I guess you're used to Union's obsession with secrecy by now. Our mission is to explore an area used by the Union scientists as a testing range for new anti-mutant weaponry. Contact with the scientists was lost approximately 12 hours ago. Most probably, the eggheads were so consumed by their experiments that they disregarded safety precautions and ended up in mutants' bellies. However, there is a chance they're still alive. We must dispatch a squad to learn about their fate.
soldier healed. Initial scans show there is at least one survivor in the mission area. Relaying coordinates now. Hopefully he stays alive until we get there. I see the enemy! Contact! He's near. I hear him. Perfect. What the hell was that? No idea. Doc? Huh. Interesting. I read about it in the Xenobiology newsletter, but never had the opportunity to witness it with my own eyes. It's a rare fungus, unique to the jungles of South America. Its fruiting body resembles cloudberries. The mushrooms explode when a large animal comes nearby, releasing spores into the open wounds and unprotected areas of the body. Fresh meat is the best growth medium for this species. It accelerates the growth process manifold. Roger that. Squad, if you don't want to become a growth medium for these cloudberries, shoot them from afar. Dead shot. Take it! Oh hell, missed! I'm exposed!
He's near. I hear him. I see the enemy! Oh, hell! Missed! Ah, hell! Missed! This is outrageous. You're compromising the experiment by destroying my test species. Actually, we came here to save you. Or haven't you noticed that all your colleagues are dead and the area is swarming with deadly spherical fungi? Nonsense. The changes I made to the species' DNA do not only increase their survivability in all climates, but also cause a significant reduce in their aggression. They have no reason to attack humans. Tell that to your lab personnel and guards. Those were pure accidents. How dare you question my talents? Movement! God damn Move it. it, he's dead! I can see that. Not our problem anymore. Union was keeping a close eye on this operation. They decided that the cloud berries are too dangerous. Union bombers are already in the air. You have five minutes to get out of there. Kill the enemy!
need to find shelter. We need to find shelter. And here's a colorful, albeit dead, example of how obsession with science and an inflated ego may lead to catastrophic sequences. Fortunately, the army bombed the hell out of this place and all mutants are dead. I'm afraid the story is far from over, Lieutenant. The bombs have destroyed mature species, which you, for some unfathomable reason, keep calling cloudberries. However, the explosion didn't just destroy the mushrooms, it also blew a lot of spores into the air. If the winds keep up, thousands of square miles may be covered, so expect to see more colonies soon. Talk about bad news. At least we know now how to fight them. And the hefty reward for this contract has already been wired to us. Great job, Commander. I'm glad you came, Commander. I'm right in the middle of studying the unusual crystals your men brought from the abandoned city. The crystals reacted with the chemicals in the box and obtained a green hue. The emission spectrum of the crystals has changed accordingly. Preliminary data suggests that a metal exposed to the radiation becomes extraordinarily durable. It will allow us to create better armor. Bye. <laughs> 